Welcome to fishing with a guy who's been too lazy to trim his beard lately. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian. You're watching Angling Anarchy. I am out fishing, musky fishing to be precise, in December on the Madison Chain of Lakes. And I have with me the artist formerly known as Noah Humfeld. We are out here musky fishing. I'm going to get a little closer. There he is. Look I at that. I you closer. <laughs> Unless it's for body heat. It's we're, freaking cold. That just got weird. Social distance fishing, I guess. I'm trying to stay away. Social fish dancing. Fish, social fish dancing. Fish, fish dancing. Okay, say that fast five times. Anywho, we are out here fishing. Uh, we don't have any suckers because we don't want to deal with that right now. It'd probably be the smart thing to do this time of year, but we're not. Um, we're just out here casting, uh, sort of a last gasp effort to get a muskie in the boat. Our season closes at the end of the month and I don't know if we're gonna make it quite that far. What do you think? No. There was a little bit of ice on the water this morning actually, so um, we've got We'll be breaking ice in a week, probably. Yeah, we've got 38, 39 degree water temps right now. Um, and other than that, I think we're just gonna try to cast and Ooh, catch a muskie. And he's watching ducks. So, this should be fun, <laughs> folks. All right, everybody. It is December on the Madison chain. Uh, it, it's, it's chilly. It's a little chilly. Uh, we've got sub 40 degree water temps. We're rocking like 38 and a half right now. I have an eight inch mini, custom X mini X uh, with the metal lip. I am trying to work this as slow as I possibly can. Contact some weeds, give it a rip, uh, kind of pump it and then let it float up a little bit. I have it on a my trusty nine foot 2020 assault stick, telescopic rod with a 400 tranks. Noah's rocking a diving rise. He's got the Lee Lures Leviathan, the Big Daddy. What is that? A 10 inch? That is the 10 inch epoxy version. That's there you the go. Big dog. So that's he's he's throwing that on a shock and awe, a 9 six shock and awe. So we've got some assault sticks rocking. We've got some baits in the water. It's chilly. Let's see if we can catch a musky. Oh, there's a fish, there's a fish. I don't think so. You kind of took off on me. Did you? Uh, you know, he was probably like a mid-30s. I mean, for this time of year, he came in halfway. Yeah. Hey, peppy, huh? Peppy is the word. That's a start. First contact. Sweet. Start Oh, there's a fish, there's a fish. Yeah. Do you stick with it really or? Uh, went deep on the second turn and then kind of disappeared. Maybe I should switch it up a little bit, Brian. Hey, that's uh, number two. Yeah. You know, I think I might just have one of those in my box. <sighs> well, it didn't get to do its thing on Eagle Lake this year, so maybe it'll do its thing on the Mad Chain today. That'd be nice. Second fish contacted within, I don't know, maybe about an hour or so. So, it's not terrible. Get out of there. 
fish. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna turn them up here. Oh, I'm so incredibly excited oh right now. Gosh, we got a muskie. <laughs> Wowza, nice. dude. Nice work. <laughs> All right. That's, that's like super exciting. Hello. Dude, so that I hit weeds. Uh -huh. I was pretty sure I was going to come in a bait just full of weeds. So I, I ripped it, gave it a couple more pops, and it almost ripped the rod out of my hand because I wasn't ready for it. That was cool. Nice. <laughs> All right. Let's get some time <laughs> There we go. Okay, fish Ooh. is free. Let's scan it. Let's... I have my handy handy scanner. Okay. Alright. Alright. Yep. Really? We got number 989-0010-0429788. That's cool. We got a tag fish, dude. That's awesome. Awesome. So we will be able to give this number to the DNR. We're going to measure this fish, and we'll know exactly when this fish was stocked and how fast it's growing. That's Boom. so cool. Awesome. Tag fish. Wow, right? this just keeps getting better and better. Yep, just slide it underneath. And I'll get her. Dude, that's gonna look so sick with that in the background. Okay. She is recording. Okay. I'm gonna get in here, get this peppy little guy. Probably like a 37 or 38 maybe. But just a super thick fish. Oh man. Look at that. <laughs> December muskies. <laughs> oh, I am so incredibly happy right now. Gorgeous. All right, let's see what you are, buddy. He is like 37 and just a touch, so we'll just call it 37. But just a nice fat fish on that Custom X 8 inch mini. We're just fishing weed edges, man. Just trying to bang a little bit of the weed edge, make some contact and put a fish in the boat. I'm gonna come back here. All right, sweetie. Let's get you back and see if anybody else is ready to do the same thing. All right. <laughs> I'm so happy right now. So very happy right now. All right, let's uh, see if Noah can get one. See if we can put number two in the boat. All right, folks, I know we talked about what bait we're using, but I'm going to try and attempt to show you how I'm using it. Nothing special. We'll just do a short little cast here. I mean, I'm basically just getting it out there, giving it a pump to get it down, do a little straight retrieve, give it a pump, maybe let it sit, pause a little bit, and just do that for the bulk of the retrieve. Give it a pump, let it sit. Um, if a fish has fallen, hopefully get it to strike on that pause. Um, the fish I caught earlier uh, was definitely because I was contacting weeds and uh, busting it through there, ripping it through, and then I, I let it sit, and that's when that fish hit. So that's how I am fishing that minnow bait. Well, that was fun. <laughs> Fishing in Madison. Yeah, it doesn't get any better than this, folks. This is fun. Getting yelled at. <laughs> or screamed at. or I'd, Oh, they're doing it to them down there. That's, that's a good time. That 
was a cool musky adventure. Uh, it's always fun to get out in the boat in December in Wisconsin. Doesn't happen all that often. Uh, thanks to Noah Humfeld, uh, it was fun to get out with him and it was very cool that he had his pit tag scanner with so that we could scan that fish and we found out that it had a tag. So we have that information and I purposely didn't film an outro out in the boat because I wanted to wait until we had that information available and I could share it with you guys. But before we get to that, I just want to say thank you everyone for watching. I really appreciate it. This is video number one of 2021, hopefully one of 52. We're going to keep on the same schedule, try to get a video out every Saturday, 8.30 Central Standard Time. I think that's the time we're going to stick with, get it out nice and early in the morning. And yeah, we've got... I don't have a plan. It's called Angling Anarchy for a reason. It's crazy. I, I don't know what's going on. We are going to try to get out and obviously fish for muskies, but season's closed now in Wisconsin. Uh, so if we get muskie fishing, it's going to have to be somewhere down south. I don't have any plans to do that until March, but we're going to have to see what happens with COVID-19, all that stuff. So it's, it's all up in the air. Luckily, I have, you know, obviously we can ice fish. Uh, we'll, we'll, I plan on doing a little bit of that. Maybe we can do another uh, river float for pike. Who knows? Maybe we can go over to uh, Milwaukee and fish for browns in the harbor. There's a lot of things we can do and uh, obviously hopefully get to muskie fishing again. I've got some old footage from Eagle Lake uh, back before. I had a, a decent camera that I would talk to and, and I don't have any b-roll for it, but I've got these really cool catches that I've never done anything with. So hopefully between maybe being able to edit those and you know talk about what happened and what happened on that trip uh, in modern times with this camera and using that old footage along with some new footage of me talking about what was going on at that time, we can throw together some cool old <laughs> vintage videos of, uh, of some old Eagle Lake trips. I think that would be kind of cool. I've got some really nice footage that just doesn't have any b-roll to go with it or talking to go with it, but we can fix that. We can make some cool videos out of that, I think. So we will try that. All right, so what you've been waiting for, the information on that fish. The Wisconsin DNR stocked that fish into Lake Monona September 16th, 2015. It was 12.6 inches long. It is an upper Chippewa River, Wisconsin strain fish. So that's the information on that fish. It had not been captured before. I was sorry, my phone was kind of in the way. I was reading it off my phone. Um, so yeah, uh, we were able to give that information uh, from when we caught it, the date, the length, all that stuff. So if it ever gets captured again, we can start to figure out what the growth rate is on that fish. All that information is really cool to have. And thank you to Muskies Inc. and uh, Capital City Muskies Inc. specifically for uh, coming up with the funds and putting that fish in the lake for us because without their help I may not have caught that fish. Uh, it's very cool that we have that organization there to help stock fish, help promote the sport, and guys I would encourage you to join Muskie Zinc and then you know, get together with the guys from your local chapter. Um, if you're starting out in the sport, it's a great way to meet people, get tips on, on the local area, uh, waters, and that sort of thing. So consider joining Muskies Inc. I think that is a, is a cool thing for all of us uh, to be a part of, and it helps the sport to grow. So with that, I'm gonna stop yapping. I will let you get back to what you were doing before. Thank you for watching, everybody. I really do appreciate it, and I'll see you on the next video.